This is good. Hi, Harry and, and Rihanna. You've just been with us uh, for the Leading Your Church into Growth conference. It's been fantastic. What, what were your impressions, Harry, first of all? Uh, of the conference? Yeah. Uh, it was wonderful to have so many people gathered together, mm. people who, who were up for it, who yeah. were excited, who mm. come with an expectancy that uh, they could change and stuff could happen. Brilliant. Rihanna? Yeah, I mean... 160 people in the room plus an extra 20 hours is a lo lovely vibe. Um, Very we good had vibe. some great conversations with people in between, just lots of people thinking really missionally. I love that. <laughs> um, and people engaging and yeah. people really wanting to go home and do stuff. Yeah. And that is very exciting for us and for everyone. And, yeah. no, and notably as well, the catering was excellent. <laughs> <laughs> we had good, very, very good food. Well, the lunches, the morning teas, can be you be more specific? Well, I think, <laughs> I think I'm thinking the cakes, really. The cakes. the cakes? Yeah, vanilla slices. Good kiwi cakes. And I'm going to be spiritual, you? the conversations around the cakes. Ah, oh, really of course. <laughs> That's what I meant. And <laughs> the worship was great. Yeah. Inspiring. Yeah. Uh, te reo Māori used. That would have been new for you. Very new and hard uh, at the beginning <laughs> to get the words out. But towards the end, I felt like I was beginning to get the hang of it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but lovely to see. What yeah. a great culture. I was doing it confidently, but not necessarily competently. <laughs> <laughs> right. That's the main thing. Any highlights, just in closing, uh, again, Harry, first highlights. Uh, um, I mean, it was... I'll be honest, probably the highlight was the uh, communion service at the end. Ah. You know, the bishop had been there journeying with us and, and uh, had been part of the conference. And then yeah. he shared some really wise words at the end. And to just gather around the Lord's table at the yeah. end to offer in our worship um, the steps that we were going to take and the sense of unity. And we're yeah. culture. We're in this together. Yeah. We're all doing it in our own particular way. Yeah. But we're not doing it on our own. It was lovely. Brilliant. Thank you. Rhiannon, final comment? Uh, actually, one of my highlights was a bit that Harry, we hadn't put in our programme, but you sort of spur of the moment got up and you talked about um, what happens if you've got no children or no youth in your oh, church yeah. and, you know, what you can do about that. And I thought that was particularly inspired and it really encouraged me and I think it encouraged lots of people it that does. you can have no one and it doesn't have to stay like that. Yeah, you, yeah. Know, you can actually start um, young people's work, children's Indeed. work. So I was really inspired yeah. by that. And I was taken by the fact that, you know, you had a can-do attitude. You started with the situation, but you had some sort of creative idea to kickstart that. Yeah, I think it's really important to not be afraid of failure, you know, because I think yeah. stuff does go wrong. That's OK. Yeah. Just, you uh, said that several times, Harry. You hit... Get back on your bike. <laughs> really, really, really yeah. important that we have that culture. It's OK. Yeah. OK. Thanks. Thank you so much.